Welcome everyone. Today we are talking about kindness. And to help us think about this this morning, let me read to you from Ephesians chapter 2, part of verse 7. So that in the coming ages, he, referring to God, might show the immeasurable riches of his grace in kindness toward us in Christ Jesus. Those are words speaking to us about the kindness of the Lord. Kindness is something that people everywhere value. We greatly appreciate it when others are kind to us. God, above all, has been kind to us. It doesn't have to be, but daily he chooses to be. The example that is mentioned here in Ephesians 2 would kind of rise to the very top of ways in which God has been kind to us. Yes, he's kind in that he gives us our daily bread, everything we need to live, but especially we see it in Jesus who gave his life for you, for me, and it is an expression of the kindness of God. He wants to be good to us, and he is. Of course, we know that having received this kindness from the Lord, that it's something that he would then have us share with the people whose lives we touch. And so it's listed in that list uh, later on in Ephesians when it comes to the fruit of the Spirit, or uh, rather in, in Galatians where Paul writes about the fruit of the Spirit as mentioned as one of those things that God by his Holy Spirit will grow in his people. It's one of the ways in which we as Christian people today in these unsettling times can express the love of God, being kind to one another. We're seeing that absent in so many places and situations in our world and nation and even in our communities. And for Christians to live out the kindness of God, the kindness that comes from the Lord, that's a way to let our light shine as Jesus would speak of it to let the light of Christ shine through us as we show kindness to other people, not just to those whom we especially like, but to people in general. And the Lord, as we do that by faith in Christ, is honored and glorified in it. Let's pray. Today, Lord, as we think about this word kindness, we are grateful that you are so very kind day in and day out in ways too many for us really to count. We pray, Lord, that we would be people who likewise overflow in your kindness as we interact with people, even people in our own homes, in our communities, in our churches. We pray, Lord, that your kindness would be something that is expressed day by day in our lives, and we pray that you are honored in all of it. This we ask in Jesus' name. Amen. Have a blessed day.